My name is Juan Madrigal. I own Protective Coatings. I started Protective Coatings with the vision of understanding more the craft that I was developing and being able to push my own limits with just things that I would see myself and different aspects of me working through it. I kind of just gave me a vision to really open up my own business and be able to make my own decisions as to how far we can push the limits of a good job. I've been in window tinting for 18 years now, so that is uh, really where I started. Different great companies that are out there that really gave me the, the experience that I have today. Uh, paint protection really is uh, material that conforms to, any, to the surface that you're installing. In the beginning, it was more of a partial coverage um, due to the fact that, I mean, the market was just opening up really with pre-designed patterns, pre-designed kits that we would just install. So it was more of a partial option and slowly transitioning to giving more coverage. For example, instead of a partial, which is just uh, your full bumper, a part of your hood and a part of your fenders, now we're able to extend it to the full panel and be able to hide the material better. Past few years, we really moved into transition into doing full vehicles, full coverage. Let's say they just buy a brand new vehicle, best, best option that you can give them is to protect what they just spend on. And I'm saying in the sense of protecting because it's uh, overall element protection. There is a great difference between what a ceramic coating is and a paint protection film is. For example, ceramic coating is going to help you maintain your vehicle where you aspects of cleaning it down, it wipes down very easy, pretty much just going to create a hydrophobic surface. Okay. Meanwhile, paint protection, what it is, it's generally creating a force field around the surface where any debris at, at any rate of speed could come in and chip the paint. When the film is there, it's really just going to absorb that impact. If it were to tear the film down, just temperature itself. Once it reaches high graded temperature, it restores itself, which is a self-healing material. Back in the day, it would be paint protection and we would have to add on a hydrophobic surface because the, the technology wasn't there. Nowadays, paint protection itself is a hydrophobic. It's gonna help you maintain your vehicle. You're gonna get the plus of not being able to scratch or any light scratches over the surface, and it's always gonna look clean. You get a 10 year warranty on paint protection, and it's designed to really last that or more because there's just been so much technology invested into the adhesives, into the materials, the coatings, that it just, it's always gonna stay glossy, it's always gonna keep its original condition. You have to understand how to conform it to the material. There is the options of a pre-cut kit that kind of just resembles the part and you're able to mold it to that shape, but there's always gonna be a minor gap or it's not gonna align really well, leaving areas exposed. Really the fun part of what I like doing now is over the years, just getting more experience, now being able to fully coat a part without any seams or any, any edges exposed by doing it in one panel. It's always gonna be a chance that we have to trim the material to a certain point. It's a very meticulous job because you need to have that experience of your blade where it, it could be easily tilled, it could easily penetrate more than it is and you eventually can dig up to the surface. Now the material is four mil stick. You have enough precision, you can score throughout the material and be able to tear it away. <laughs> the material creates like a whistling sound when the blade is running perfectly. It's actually very interesting when you're doing the job because you, you, you know you're going to perfection. On the GT500 Heritage, we ended up going with a product from Avery Denison, which is Supreme Gloss Defense, uh, throughout the whole vehicle. And in some areas, we, for instance, uh, the hood scoop, we ended up using that NOR product, which is also an Avery Denison product. Once I tried it, I fell in love with it. It's something that is my process. It definitely cut down a lot of time. I love the adhesive. The adhesive, when I tension, when I pull, it's a very easy product to work with and it gives you amazing results. It was a process of multiple days, really. We ended up covering from bumper to bumper, wheel to wheel. My favorite aspect of it was definitely the wheels. First time I'm able to work on a wheel kit. Best part about it is we covered 100% of the wheel, which I would never think would be possible. We decided to do the wheel because they're rare and they're expensive. Well, really what makes these wheels stand aside from any other wheels is that they're not an alloy wheel. They are carbon fiber, Essentially, we ended up adding the paint protection film over every square inch of the wheel itself, trying to design the best pattern to minimize the exposure of seams. It's not typical that you can do the wheel. This is an opportunity that presented itself given the fact that these carbon fiber wheels come along with the vehicle, and it's very rare to have that. Well, paint protection film was initially patented to protect uh, helicopter blades. In this sense, we're given the opportunity to bring it back to its original idea. Let's say a rotary blade from a helicopter spins at a faster rate than a wheel. Well, now knowing that, we were just able to feel comfortable and figure out the right trims, figure out the right method to cover the wheel. Coverage is different. Um, the front wheels are constructed differently than the rear wheels, meaning that there's a ceramic liner um, 
to absorb heat for the front wheels and the rear it's really just nothing but carbon fiber so being able to get in the dish and just cover the full mount um, over the surface it was a great experience i mean it's full confidence as to we can get this done where a customer doesn't even imagine uh, it's not in even in coming thinking that the, its wheels can get done for its vehicle so now being able to offer that when the opportunity presents itself it's great